So I've done one of these videos already, but I'm going to do another one real quick um, on how to boil a proper egg and whether it's fresh or store purchased. Super easy to do, so it will peel. You don't have to peel them immediately. Um, you can peel them whenever you feel like it. So it's the first step is to excuse me for the noise is to put cold water in a pot or hot water or whatever and bring it to a boil and then take cold eggs out of the fridge. These are store purchased eggs. I'm going to do a combination of store and fresh. Some of them will crack because it's so uh, the temperature extremes are so different but don't sweat it. I'm going to see if these little F's on the fresh eggs from my hens last. If they don't, we'll just know that it's a mixture and I can peel a bunch of them for you. So we're going to put all these in there. Um, this is a medium egg, so I'm going to go for about 13 minutes. If there were larger eggs, I'd keep it at a boil for a little longer. But you just put your top on, set the temperature down low, and put your timer on 13 and then wait. Okay everybody, my timer has just gone off, so I'm going to now bring my pot over to the sink, and I'm just going to steam you out, drain the water. I'm going to give that a second, feel the eggs. I just do this to cool them down really quickly. And then I'm going to put them in the ice water. I could take them out one at a time, but I'm lazy. That egg, you can see, is, is broken open, but most of the other ones, this one's got a small crack in it, or a big crack in it. But otherwise, they're all good. And you can still put a cracked egg like that since it's hard boiled into the fridge. So I'm just going to let these guys be happy in here until they're totally cold. And then we'll peel a couple and I'll show you what it looks like inside. It should just be about, I don't know, 10 minutes or less. All right, so it's been about six minutes. And I'm going to peel a fresh egg for you, a little F stayed on there, and a store bought egg for you. So here's a little F egg, and here's store-bought egg. We'll do the store-bought egg first, and I think most people would say that um, that would peel easily because, you know, they're older eggs. Put it down here. Anyway, shut them right off. No problemo. Now the freshy fresh egg. This is the way that I crack eggs, and maybe that has something to do with it, too. I just tap the end and roll it. Look at that. So anyway, this is the overcap. Cold water in a pan or a pot, bring it to a boil. Cold eggs right out of the refrigerator into said pan. 13 minutes for medium sized eggs, 14 minutes for large, extra large eggs. And then plunge them into, we'll cool them down, plunge them into ice water. And uh, then you can put them away in the fridge or peel them. And I want to just show you the inside of the egg so you can see it doesn't have that, um, God, what is that stuff? The green ring. I can't remember what causes that, but it's from overcooking. Uh, so that's how easy it is. So go ahead and, and try it and see um, what you think. And this is just by far the easiest way to cook eggs. There you go. So what I'm going to do with these eggs that are still in the shell is I'm just going to take them out of the cold water and put them in the fridge like this. And like I said before, oh that one's half out, maybe I'll just eat that one. Um, these will keep in the fridge and when you want an egg you just pull it out and peel it and they'll peel like this forever. So it's not like you have to peel them when they're warm. And obviously they're cool because they've just been cooled. So anyway, there you go. Let me know if you have any comments. See ya.